And Jeremy Brilliant covering our big story of the day. Thanks so much. And our own Bob Kravitz has something to say about this Twitter storm. We'll be talking with Bob Kravitz live in studio. We'll get his reaction today at 1230. Well, a judge has now ruled Olympic athlete Oscar Pistorius is not guilty of premeditated murder. But that doesn't mean that he is clear of the shooting that killed his girlfriend, Reva Steenkamp. NBC's Duncan Golistani has the latest on the verdict. The Oscar Pistorius trial might be drawing to a close, but it is getting no less dramatic. The judge has started delivering her verdict and in the process, giving her opinion on the evidence she heard during the trial. Oscar Pistorius sobbed when she said that he was a poor and evasive witness. But she largely sided with his version of events, believing him when he said he had no idea it was his girlfriend, Reva Steenkamp, behind the bathroom door when he fired four bullets through. She said the prosecution's case was largely circumstantial. The evidence failed to establish that the accused had the requisite intention to kill the deceased, let alone with pre meditation and she cleared Pistorius of premeditated murder and murder she then turned to the lesser charge of culpable homicide which is pretty much like involuntary manslaughter she said even if Pistorius believed there were intruders in the bathroom he had other choices he could have gone to the balcony and shouted for help he could have dialed for security, but he didn't. And in doing so, she said Pistorius was negligent. Using that word negligent seems to indicate that the judge is going to deliver a guilty verdict of culpable homicide, which carries a sentence of up to 15 years. But she didn't get that far before she could. She abruptly adjourned court, saying it would continue tomorrow. Duncan Golastani, NBC News, Pretoria, South Africa.